Hello guys, it's Katie and welcome back to Steal the Spotlight. Today we're going to be looking at some of the biggest trends from previous decades. Usually what's old does become new again with the fashion industry constantly recycling styles, so I thought it'd be fun to look at some of the key moments in our style evolution. Kicking things off in the 1950s, I cannot look past white polka dots when I think of this era, so I was absolutely ecstatic to find this dress just at my local thrift store. I think it totally nails that 50s aesthetic with this particular silhouette. If you wanted to amp it up even more though, you could totally pair a tulle skirt underneath for that fuller effect. When it comes to the accessories, you can't go past the white block heels, red lipstick and a neck scarf. Moving on into the 1960s and my personal favourite part of fashion in this decade would have to be Twiggy's iconic look. It really took a lot of influence from that mod style which is what inspired me to recreate this outfit as well. My dress is actually vintage from the 60s so it did all the hard work for me and I really tried to play up that theme with these accessories but I think the dress is actually still really wearable for today's style as well. I'm sure most of us are very familiar with the fashion from the 1970s considering quite a few of their trends have also been in style for the last few years. I have featured a lot of 70s aesthetic on my channel previously so I tried to switch things up a little bit for you here today by going out of my comfort zone and teaming this mini dress over my trusty old flares. There's so many options when it comes to the 70s but my personal favourite is just sticking with earthy tones and throwing on a pair of round sunglasses. The 1980s have a lot of different trends on offer, whether you're into the aerobics style, bright neon colours, metallics, big shoulder pads, there's a lot on offer, most of all crazy and fun. Obviously I decided to go for a kind of Madonna inspired ensemble, she wore a lot of lace, leather and layered up those chain necklaces. Moving on into the 1990s, and this is of course another era that we are very, very familiar with. And I grew up in the 90s, so I always have a soft spot for it. I recently did a Spice Girls lookbook covering some of the more outrageous trends. So this time around, I thought I'd go with something a little bit more classic. I think that tartan or plaid and denim vests were something that just about everyone was wearing in the 90s, whether you were a celebrity or just an everyday joke. I hope you guys enjoyed this style recap. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments which decade is your favorite for fashion. I would love to know. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next time.